Hi, this is Josh from ChessVideos.tv, and I thought today I would give a little tour of one of our a training tool we have on our site. It's a chess endgame simulator, and it's one that I use all the time, and it's fairly popular with our members. So I think you might find it interesting. The idea of the tool is that it helps players in an interactive way improve their endgames. Studying from an endgame book or analyzing your games is an excellent way of sort of learning theoretically how it works, but this is a way you can gain practical experience in key endgame positions. So what we've done is created a grouping of various key endgame positions that you can then play against Crafty. So we've used the Crafty chess engine and connected it to our site, and now you can play against the computer these various positions. So we've got checkmates you can practice, like the queen, the rook, etc. And then we have more advanced positions where players can master things like the Lucena position, which I've recorded an earlier video about, or winning with a queen against a bishop, etc. And then one thing I really enjoy is that we've sort of collected several famous endgames, and you'll put yourself in the shoes of somebody like Capablanca or Kasparov, and you'll be able to play a position which they won beautifully. And the nice thing about that is, after you play it a while and maybe analyze and practice playing against Crafty, you can then look at the analysis from the actual game and see how it compares. So, as you can see, it's, it's been pretty popular. Crafty's made over 500,000 moves against our opponents. So this, this is a very popular feature of the site, and one that I know has improved my end game play tremendously. I mean, some of these advanced ones are very difficult. And, like I said, you'll gain sort of the equivalent of real-world experience playing these positions. So before I show off a few of the positions, I want to clarify the difference between random and static positions. If you go to the endgame simulator on our site, and by the way, the way you can get here is you visit the chessvideos.tv homepage, and you'll see this is what it looks like if you visit chessvideos.tv. On the left, you'll see chess tools, and you click the link that says endgame simulator. And this is one of our many training tools, including the Visualization Trainer, which we might discuss in a later video. But that will take you to the Endgame Simulation page. And so it has all these different exercises we talked about. And there are two kinds of positions. There's the randomly generated ones and the static ones. Ones that are in bold are randomly generated, so it'll be just a random position that has maybe queen and king versus king checkmate, or queen versus pawn on the seventh rank, etc. And then the ones that aren't in bold are Whenever you play it, you're going to get the same position. Of course, this makes sense for the famous endgames, but also some of these ones, like the Lucena position, etc. So the idea here is that you can you know, watch an endgame video on our site, and then you can try it out on your own. So let's say we go to one of the basic checkmate ones. So you click the link, and that'll take you into the endgame simulator itself. And so you're going to practice checkmating. Now, it randomly generates a position, so this is obviously a very easy position. You just go queen b2, and then checkmate, you win. So if you want to try it again, all you need to do is click refresh for the page, and you'll get a new randomly generated position. And so from here, as you can see, you're white, and you can just move, and Crafty will play the other side. So it's all automated, and it's a great way to practice the basic checkmates, or even more advanced uh, checkmates, or endgame positions, I should say. And it'll keep a little move counter at the bottom as you're playing. So that's the first of uh, Endgame Simulator. So we've got these checkmates, and then the advanced positions. We've got the Lucena position. So this is static. You'll always have this position, and you'll be white. And then we've got things like the famous Capablanca Endgame. Um, not going to play it because I don't want to give it away, but he's very. It's all about rook activity in this position. Um, so you can practice that one too. And we're the Endgame Simulator is a great tool, and so we're still working on expanding it. So this library of games will probably grow. And if you find out you like it a lot, you know, post in our forums, and we're probably going to expand this some. So the Endgame Simulator is just one of several chess training tools we have at chessvideos.tv, and one that I think can really help players develop their endgame skills. So give it a try, and maybe you can play as well as Capablanca or Kasparov, or even Tom.